Kavanaugh with HIVHero.org and HeroNews.org. And I'm here with the amazingly talented and super handsome Eric Truby Bourne. How are you? I'm very good. Thank you. So welcome. And you are making your Broadway debut right now. How does that feel? It's been very exciting. Uh, just the, the preparation into the opening of Fiddler and, and experiencing my debut. The cast is amazing. They're, it's truly a family there. We... Uh, there's just so many beautiful souls and artists and talent and 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 experiencing their gifts and their craft every night and every day has just um, taken my career and, and anything I ever dreamt of to uh, to a whole new a whole new level. So Eric, one thing I found fascinating about you and so cool is that you and your husband were chosen to represent Tiffany's in their new same-sex couple ads. Tell me how that happened. Um, one day last year, last October, uh, my agent called and just said that she received an email and they were looking for Thomas and myself to go into a callback that Saturday and meet with the people from Tiffany's and from the, uh, the ad agency. Uh, we got the call from the agent. She said that they wanted to go forward with us and that they, we were going to represent um, a real-life gay couple in the, in the next Tiffany's ad. But really, when, the, when it came out, and then you really realize how, how far the reach is with this picture and this ad and how big of a deal it was, especially with this past year in the equality fight, then it, be, it started to settle in as something that was very, very proud of by both of us and, and very honored to be the couple that could represent engagement rings from Tiffany's. So. so Eric, you've got quite an impressive career, but a lot of it is dance oriented. And I know that you were a principal dancer at Parsons. How was that? It was... Uh some of the best years in my career so far. So Eric, one of the reasons we chose you to be the Broadway Hero of the Month is your amazing work for charity. Specifically, I want to mention the Fire Island Dance Festival, which was one of my favorite events for Broadway Cares, Equity Fights AIDS. Why is that event so important to you? For me, uh, it's, it's my way of uh, giving my art and expressing my connection with my friends that have suffered from HIV and AIDS and being able to kind of tell a story for them and, and give back to them in the way that I know best, which is through expe expression of dance. But It's really, truly an amazing event on the beach, on Fire Island. It's absolutely gorgeous. Please go to dra.org. That's Dancers Responding to AIDS and also Broadway Cares Equity Fights AIDS website, which is broadwaycares.org to find out about it and it's really great so please get your tickets for that so eric as you know we're a site for newly diagnosed and people living with hiv there's a lot of things going on now with prep but still there's a rise in other stds because people still can get them without using a condom uh what is your message to people that are young and your age about the importance of safe sex practices uh what i would say to youth growing up uh, in safe sex is Always practice safe sex, even if uh, you feel pressured not to. Remember that it is about you and it is about protecting yourself. Um, and and sex is fun, and you don't have to uh, sacrifice anything by not wearing a condom. So condoms are hot, and uh, and practice safe sex. So, Eric, I want to thank you so much for being our Broadway Hero of the Month. And please go see him in Fiddler on the Roof. It's amazing. Where can we see that? The Broadway Theater, uh, 1681 Broadway, 53rd Street. Come on down. Come, come, come see this handsome man in Fiddler on the Roof. It's a fantastic show. And I'm sure that your career is just going to go up, up, and up. Leading man here. Watch for him. Thank you, Michael. Thank you so much.